Hello, this is Tanner Tech, and today I'm going to show you how I built a 3D printer out of CD drives. So this CD drive 3D printer was built almost entirely out of scrap CD drives and scrap metal. The Y-axis CD drive was from an old DVD player. The X-axis CD drive was built from a Walkman. The Z-axis was built from the CD drive of a computer. The bottom of this 3D printer, the base, was built out of the base of the DVD player. As you can see, I used the original gearing from the CD drive to drive the axes. All of the parts of this printer were bolted together using hex nuts. The whole thing is quite stable and doesn't bend or do anything when I pick it up. The whole printer weighs about one and a half pounds. All of the original CD drive motors were kept too. All the motors are driven by these two L298N motor controller chips. I had wires from every motor running to the output ports of these L298N chips. On the chips, ground and positive are both connected together, but the 5 volt in output pin is not used. The ground goes to the Arduino ground too, as well as the power ground. There are three different wires the Arduino uses to control each motor. One wire is enable, and the other two control which direction the motor will go. These, the enable pin is controlled by pulse width modulation to control how, what the speed of the motor is. These all go to the different pins on my Arduino Mega. I have not found the right software to control this printer, as it does not use stepper motors like most normal printers do. If you have any idea on what to use for uh, software, please leave it in the comments, because I would really like to know. This is the test code that I use for my 3D printer. This printer works when approximately 6 volts is going to the L298 motor controller ports. Now to see this 3D printer in action. Thank you for watching.